say, where is your son? Where is your child? I don't have a child. Mm. They told you so? Mm? There was never a lady that told you that she's pregnant? Yes, we broke up. No, no, no. I'm saying there was never a lady that told you that she's pregnant. Yes. No? Huh? Yes, she was. I see a lady, I see you speaking with a lady that is like someone in your past life. Yeah. You know, the lady said, I'm pregnant. Yeah. And from there, you don't know what happened. Yes, yes. Yeah? Yes. Mm. She okay. told me that she's pregnant. Uh, mm. I think he... I'm sure I'm meeting you for the first time. Yes. I've never seen you before. Yes. And I just came down now. Yes, yes. You saw me, I just came now now. Me and my God, we just came now now. Oh, yes. So now... So she never told you about the, the child? Yes, she didn't tell me. She only just told me that she's pregnant. She so. only told you that she's pregnant. Yeah. So mm -hmm. what happened after that, she didn't told me. What happened after that? Yes. She never told you. Can yeah. I get a small volume? And from there, that's oh. how the relationship died. Ye yes. Are you hearing me? Yes. Let me tell you this. If I tell you that there's a child somewhere, would you believe me? Because I don't know him. Can you hear that? I'm seeing him for the first time. And I look at him and say, where's your child? And there was a lady that was pregnant. And after the lady became pregnant, the relationship was boom. And after he died, the man never got an information anymore about what has happened. Are you hearing me? So now, God has forgiven you. From today, you're starting a new chapter Amen. of your life. Amen. Because the lady didn't tell you much, but she did a abortion. Yes, uh, I saw a vision. Ah, ah. Let's leave a vision. The lady didn't tell you much, but she did a abortion. Yes, yes, yes. And... I want to pray for you. There's, remember, I don't know you. It's true. Are you hearing me? Mm. I'm seeing you for the first time. Mm. And I'm telling you about a child that no one knows. Yes. I mean, I'm telling you about the pregnancy that no one knows. Yes. Are you hearing me? Yes. So now, God has forgiven you. Today, you are starting a new chapter of your life. Amen. Let's leave. Let's leave visions. Sin is sin. Are you hearing me? I'm not condemning him. He's my brother. And I know there's, there's plan of God in his life. So, but a sin is a sin. So now today, come here, I pray for you. Amen. In Jesus mighty name. You're free. Sister, you, let me pray for you. Your spirit of the old want to come back. Can you take out your mask? I know you, eh? I know this lady. Your, your spirit of the old want to come back to you. Yes. Are oh, you remember? Yes. Your old character. Yes. I want to come back. So now please check your life and be more prayerful. Mm. You understand? Yes. Because the enemy is attacking you. Yes. You understand? Yes. Now the plan of Satan. Satan wants you to have this man, you still not get satisfied. You have that one, you still not get satisfied. Okay. You understand? Yes. Which is something used to happen to you. Yes. When you are growing up. Yes. So now, but today I'm praying for you. This demon will leave you. <laughs> I don't know if she's laughing or it's a demon. 
Let me hear. <laughs> yeah, huh? yeah, <laughs> who, do, who do you think you are? <laughs> mm. Let me speak with you and, pro and pray for you and release you. Come on. Come on. Come. Lift him up. Brother, one day you dreamed a snake. Yes. Are you hearing me? Yes. And that snake, when you were dreaming it, you saw like it's biting you. Yes. Are you hearing me? Yes. So now that was an attack. Because since then, you feel your blood somehow. Yes, and it's your true. your heart. It's true. So now I'm praying for you. God is healing you. Hey. Lift him up. And you will be number one to be blessed in your family. Amen. All the suffering of your father, you'll be number one. Amen. To remove this suffering. Amen. Let me just pray for two, three people. And we close. Bring him in. Bring him in. You grew up in a family of people who believe in another church. Yeah, that's true. Now you're hearing me? Yes. So now I'm seeing this spirit that is around you. Uh, they used to do what we call the dialogue. Uh, you know, they used to perform. I can't mention here. Yeah. Uh, because, you know, these days we need to hide. We can't be speaking about other people's churches as if, you know, we are the better ones. Uh -uh. The Bible says, let them grow together. And they will reach before God in the day of judgment. Amen. Are you hearing me? So now, you know the church I'm talking about. Yes, I know. So now the spirit has tied everyone, including you. That's the reason why when you're growing up, you used to experience a spiritual wife. That's, yeah, that's you true. You understand? Amen. And sometimes when you go to the bathroom, something comes out of your private before you urinate. So now today God will deliver you and you'll be free. Even your marriage will be free. Jesus! Hey, the way you're so quiet, eh? Are you afraid? Eh? Why are you so quiet? Brother, brother, your marriage is also free. Jesus! And that business, that business will grow now. Jesus. You demon! The business you want to do is coming. In Jesus' mighty name. They took your car? Yes. Huh? Yes. The bank took your car? Yes, they did. Huh? Yeah. I want to pray for you so that God can give you another one. Thank you. <laughs> and listen, sometimes we force blessings, can't they? there's a better blessing that is coming. Amen. Oh, you hear me? Amen. Because this car is not a, a nice car. Yeah. So now the, the one that is coming, you, it's a smaller car. I want God to give you an SUV. Thank you. Because the time they were taking it, the time the sheriff came, your spirit was so down. I was so down. Oh, you hear me? Yeah. And you are starting to question God, that God, why me? Yeah. In all these things. Yeah. God wants to restore you today. Thank you. Come on. Come on. Come on. So where were you working before? Uh, I'm still working to the same company, Randwater. You are still working in the same company? Yes. When did you start working there? Yes, sir. Where were you working before you worked there? I was working with Temporal uh, to the other contract. Mm. Because the reason why I'm asking, your, your job needs prayer. Are you hearing me? No. Your job needs prayer. Can you hear me? Yes. Come here. Let me, let me pray for you for this, because if not, they can, these people can cause you problems. Come. Your job needs prayer. Are you hearing me? Yes. You have got a lot of challenges there. You understand? Yes, I know. Now, that's a, sometimes you feel like 
better you go somewhere. Yes, I think so. So don't go anywhere. Are you ready? Yes. God will promote you there. I receive but it. By fire, by force. I receive it. Because I saw, I saw one man who's giving you problems there. You know, it's like people are just hating you for nothing. Yes, yes, that's true. So now, be ready for a testimony. I receive it. I receive it.